Let's try that again. And, <gasps> hey. Hey, welcome to Washington Wine Girl. I kind of look like, um, I, nah, let's just, I look. Anyway, moving on. Um, I should probably think about my clothing choices probably before I record videos, but I am completely over that because I've already had a bottle of wine. And now I'm on bottle number two for the evening. It's Sunday, uh, December 2nd? Second, I think. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, it is December 2nd. Ha <laughs> ha! Found it! Anyway, <laughs> okay, that's a whole minute wasted. I apologize. Okay, so, faster, funnier. Um, I'm drinking, I may have already reviewed this one before, but I am now having the Mercer Pinot Gris 2016. It's, it's light. It's refreshing. I already had a red tonight. I, all I have is the notes is from 2015, but it's still kind of, it's a Pinot Gris, so they're not going to change relatively that much. Peach, melon, and honeysuckle. Yeah, it's got all those. Um, yeah, it actually kind of does, actually, now that I think about it. Anyway. So, like I said, I may have already reviewed this before. Um, I got this um, at a pretty decent deal uh, a little bit ago. And I was like, oh no, I don't have my wine chilled, but I for forgot that I keep my apartment at like 60 degrees. So I'm like, well, that's perfect white wine drinking temperature. Well, close to it. Um, it's, it's quite lovely, actually. Anyway. So, um, I had, a, I had a thought. There was a thought there. Um, social media and wine. You know, a lot of people, like, kind of shun social media because they don't want their information, blah, 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 whatever. However, sometimes joining up various wineries and various wine bars or wine wine things in your area will get you information about wine events and wine social outings and wine releases and wine special parties and wine things that like wouldn't show up on normal day-to-day -day things you know get a throwaway email address and check it every once in a while Sign up for wine mailing lists. Sign up for things that are wine related. If you want to like get more into wine, but you don't want to spend a lot of money, a lot of times there's like wine release parties. And sometimes those wine release parties, you don't have to pay any money for the tasting. I mean, not to say that you're not going to buy bottles anyway, because that's the whole kind of part and parcel and be like, hey, come and drink our wine for free. And look, it's so freaking delicious, you're going to want to buy all of the bottles. I mean, that's what they're going for. That's, you know, that's the thinking of the wine, probably the thinking of the wine people. They're like, if we give them snacks and free wine, they'll buy wine. And so they make money with whatever. Blah, blah, blah. So, but sometimes there's other things, you know, uh, new wineries opening in the area. I mean, I live in Seattle, there's wineries opening on a, I wouldn't say on a regular basis, but on a somewhat regular basis, and it's lovely. And sometimes those wineries have release parties, and they're like, come on down, and we're going to have snacks, and you can just drink for free and have snacks, and I'm like, great, because sometimes, you know, you're broke, and although, you know, you do have, you know, the, the collection um, sometimes you want to just try something new and, you know, try new varieties and try new things. Um, so social media isn't your enemy. I mean, if you want to just start a Facebook account just for signing up for various wine things, I mean, hell, your social media would just be like this thing of all the different wine things. And people, wineries post stuff all the time and a lot, you know, you know, you thumbs up, you like their stuff, you know, that, that shows them that you're interested in their, in their wines, you know, you might get perks that way. Not 
to say that, you know, getting perks from wineries late is the in, in, end all, but sometimes it's kind of fun. And you get to learn more about wine. That's the key. Learning and learning more about wine. Anyway, I'm going to keep drinking my Mercer Pinot Gris that I got at a reasonable discount um, from our shop nearby. And that's it. Five and a half minutes. Done. Bye.